do the stretches because this voice is about to go loud. Oh yeah, come on, stretch it out. Stretch it out. Why are we stretching stretch action? <laughs> There's no video footage of this, thank God. Okay. Mm. Do you want to say the thing or shall I say, say the thing? It's time to do the intro. What, did it, what was my usual intro? I don't know. I don't have a usual intro actually. What up, people look alive! Oh yeah! It's the Scarlet E-Winger here with another hypothetical for your brains. Hypothetical! <laughs> I'm here with Tess, the man, Tess. The legend. The, the voice legend himself. The guy who just is never usually around until I'm around. Yeah. You don't know me, but I know you guys. And I'll <laughs> see you there. Yeah. Huh. <laughs> don't, don't be weirded out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Today's hypothetical is sports hybrids. Yeah. When you take a sport and mix it with anything that has sport, like sports entertainment, or an actual sport, or a fantasy sport. Yes. So yes, we're, we're combining things and making an amalgamation of fun. Wait, we can also include fantasy sports? Yeah, yes, 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 yes. Oh, it's <laughs> about to go down. Okay, who, do you want to start or should I start? I think the host shall lead in and then we mm. have to follow up. Okay, I'll go in swinging. All right. Take the sport I love, soccer. <laughs> plus. <laughs> Don't laugh yet. <laughs> soccer plus wrestling. Soccer plus wrestling. That, like WWE wrestling. All right. All right. <laughs> um. So picture this. You're playing a match. They're playing the match normally. Mm -hmm. And then someone kicks the ball towards the keeper. And the keeper just goes for a save. Just the last minute before he saves, he pulls his hands away. The ball, the goal goes in, takes off his shirt, and it's the opposition team. <laughs> <laughs> Top 10 anime betrayal of 2019. <laughs> I'm just, like, every rule is there. Like, transfers can happen mid-match. Holy shit. If, some, if the goal goes in, but the ref was not there to see it, it's not a goal. You can even simulate goals. You know that thing Eddie Guerrero used to do where yeah. he would toss the chair at you and then fall? Uh -huh. You can do that with the ball. You just take it, throw it into the opposition net, and he's like, go, ref, go! When he looks, has to make the judgment call. Ah, uh, you know. It's like, just like, is it a goal, not a goal? He listens to the fans, the fans are like, it's a goal! He gives it as a goal. <laughs> I can just imagine if it had to happen in, in SA, right? It will be there to save the goal. Drop <laughs> kick. It's like, ah, gents, gents. No, Mvana, extreme rules. Extreme rules. Or oh, like, oh, the interviews. I can just see the interviews now. It's like, my client, Ronaldinho, will not play this match until such and such steps up. And then everyone has a special move. So they keep... <laughs> The best keeper just saves, and it's like nothing gets past my god hand. And then someone shows <laughs> up. Is that so? The Ooh. Celtic cross! <laughs> Not even. The broke kick just. <laughs> just broke, and then, they, and then he saves it. Or, or someone taps the ball, the ball just rolls to the net. And then you see that the keeper just do that weird crawling thing they do. <laughs> That's so wrong. People are like, no! The striker's running full speed, he starts crawling, and then he grabs the ball last minute, and it's like, yeah! The ref wasn't looking, so the <laughs> ref kicks the keeper into the net. <laughs> ref, 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 the ball went in, the goal went in. Oh, the subs, the subs happen at any moment. <laughs> <laughs> no, even better, they are surprised subs, even the coach doesn't know, it's like, eh? What the hell? You just see someone. Ruben, damn, where the hell did you come from? You just see someone run, run into the field. Yeah! <laughs> Picture running in. <laughs> Tangles the hell out of whoever's having the ball. Oh, no, no, no. Rub <laughs> Picture, Big E. Oh, yeah. Big E just comes in, like, drops people, everyone's <laughs> on the floor in pain. He just walks to the goal, <laughs> taps the ball in. We win! Yeah! And the one, the technical gifted ones, the only ones that like actually play the sport properly. They dribble, they play, oh, they're just there styling on everyone. Just, woo, like, ta -da! I can just imagine this amalgamation of a sport. <laughs> <laughs> I would definitely pay to watch that live. I would definitely pay to watch that live. <laughs> and you know, like, you know the thing they usually, there's that, that special event thing where someone's down and it's like, I need a, I need a tag team partner. 
and I choose one of the fans, and he gets a fan. <laughs> so remember that guy. Yeah. Uh, like for people who don't know, who, who don't follow South African soccer, there's this man, Dolly, <laughs> during a during a Chiefs match when they were supposed to do a sub, he put on a, a Kaiser Chiefs T-shirt and then starts doing like warm ups. And then people are like, is it gonna go in? Because I really want this man to go in. <laughs> and then he just became a thing. Yo, he was just there like, this is my time. <laughs> I've been training for this. He's like, I'm, a, I wanna put, I'm gonna put it in if I, if I can find it. But, uh, but, but this man and this man is an entire mood. Yo. Even though you haven't been training, you're ready. <laughs> now or never. This is 100% of the shots you don't take. This is my shot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. that, that's mine, straight up. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> but I could totally see that being a thing, and it would be very popular in it, SA. It would be popular. It would even <laughs> somehow be more popular than the MLS in America. It's like one, rest, wrestling, and two, like a football. You get a boring sport and an amazing sport, you put them together, what do you get? That. You get something that's watchable, but let's be honest, we're only watching it because people get injured, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It should be a side of surprise subs. <laughs> the fans choose the surprise sub. The coaches there. I feel like the coaches would be useless at this point. <laughs> they just be there like, yes, give me more money, fools. They're basically yeah. like the advocates or those managers. They do basically nothing, but they are there. They're there because, you know... They, they make the wrestler more entertaining if they don't speak English. <laughs> or in Brock Lesnar's case, if they don't speak human. Because that man's crazy. Dude, the, the first time I heard Brock Lesnar's voice, I was shocked. Yeah, it's more high-pitched than you think it is. It is way high. Like, when you see Brock Lesnar, you're imagining a voice like, Yeah! You're expecting something from Darth Vader-esque type voices. Darth Vader move up. Wait, that's one voice I Not like... Palpatine, but with a base. Yes. With like a hardcore. The dark base. side of the force. Exactly. <laughs> like that voice, but more anger. And then it's like, come on, John, sign the damn contract. I'm like, what? What the? Did you breathe in here? <laughs> How much? Did, huh? No wonder your chest is so huge. You breathe helium. You don't have it on you. <laughs> you exhale helium, my guy. <laughs> Just go into the production business. You will be rich. You will be amazing. Just like. <laughs> Just as those guys who blow up balloons. Just like this man can blow up ten balloons with one breath. Just He's <laughs> like, okay. Yo man. Oh, man. <laughs> what, what what would I call this amalgamation of mine? Hmm. Insert thinking music. <laughs> WWS World Weirdness Soccer. Okay, that was dumb as a. I have no clue. Combat Ball. We have a name. Combat Ball. Coming to you next millennia, I think. Maybe we still have to make it a thing. Yeah. Copyright pending. Yes. Whoever, whoever's listening to this, if you own a soccer team, make it a thing. Make it a thing. And we will endorse you with we'll... our collective 40 rands. Plus yes. whatever Scarlet has. On him, cash. <clears throat> I don't like cash on me. We will make it. A th we will support you with our collective forty rands. Yes, yes, yes. Don't worry, we'll have you. We'll, we'll have you covered. We'll. You can. You, uh, we're, we're doing the, the thing. The, the John thing. Cena thing. Yeah. The one that he. Why did he stop doing that? Actually. Um. Uh, this was still in his days when he had the fu as his signature move. Yeah. Then he became more family friendly. So yeah. it's like. Yeah. Yeah. Wrestling yeah. was raw as hell back in the day. Until Ooh. they made it PG. Oh, PG wrestling is so sad. Oh, it's yeah. so sad. <laughs> but uh, anyway, back to, back, back to what we were doing. Back to the hypothetical. Yes, now it's your turn. <laughs> Alright. So, um, there's no doubt that we have some hardcore boxing fans. Oh. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> now, <laughs> imagine this. Boxing... But with Quidditch. Now, for everybody who doesn't know, Quidditch is this game in Harry Potter where you ride on a flying broomstick. This is not the weird part. <laughs> <laughs> you ride on a flying broomstick and you have to chase this little, like you have to throw a ball through a hoop. 
And to get the ultimate win in the game, you have to catch this little golden ball called a snitch. You get that and your team just automatically wins, regardless of who has more points. And now, take out that aspect of Quidditch. So it's just dudes on brooms that fly really high up in the sky, right? And boxing. <laughs> and boxing. <laughs> so drive by punches. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> I'm about to run you this fake <laughs> in air, boy! <laughs> Wait, so you have to control the broomstick and throw haymakers. Just, I'm imagining them riding the broomsticks like surfboards, so it's like, <laughs> Oh, I'ma get you! I'ma get you! Stop running away! Like, Mike Tyson is just there, I'ma get you! I'ma get you! Stop running away, you croissant! <laughs> so, <laughs> flying at mock speeds with haymakers Wow! <laughs> I, mean, I can imagine there would be quite a few fatalities. <laughs> but at the end of the day, it would be very entertaining to watch grown men trying to not die mid-air. <laughs> <laughs> On a broom. On a broomstick. And even if they die, you can just sweep them up with your broom. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna bring one aspect back in. The snitch. This time, it's that one guy who in high school, throughout his life, he's just like, yeah, that guy did it. Oh. You know, get him on, tie him to a broomstick and have the broomstick just fly randomly. It's like, whoever can punch him off of the broomstick wins. <laughs> and then everybody's like, get him! But now everybody has a concussion, so there's like three of him. And it's so like, it's like, for the first, <laughs> th first five rounds, it's the high velocity boxing, and then you introduce the snitch. Mm -hmm. Oh, that... That, that sounds amazing. Just, yeah! But now you see five of him, so he's like, which one? He's you just know, like, I'm innocent! <laughs> Ma'am, help! The teacher's down in the crowd. Put him in a body bag! <laughs> all of the bad kids, all of the kids who unfairly got detention. <laughs> Kill him! <laughs> all, all of the gangbangers on the ground. <laughs> As soon as he drops, we as soon we as, pop he drops. As, soon as he drops, we're gonna make him a new mud hole. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, what would we call this one? Oh man, what was it? Mm. Atomic punch? I don't know. I feel like we might uh, squid, squid boxing. No, it has to be something that sounds violent. Mm. Team deathmatch. Isn't that from Color Duty? Good point. Um, <laughs> copyright is a big Croissant. Um, oof. Oh, wait, I swore. Can I, can I still do that on YouTube? I'll bleep it out. All right, bleep it out. Bleep yeah. it out, please. Thank you. Yes. No, wait, put a squeaky sound over it. Oh, yeah. Beep. <laughs> <laughs> squeaky duck. I don't know why I shot that with my mouth. <laughs> um, what would we call it? Um, hmm. Sky fists. I, I don't know. It's a it's a work in progress. I'll get back to you with the pending trademark. <laughs> uh, at this point, I feel like we just just give it an actual name, Lesnar. One time, <laughs> Lesnar. <laughs> oh, we could have Brock Lesnar that just drop kicking people off of their brooms and hijacking. <laughs> <laughs> Pulls through with like five brooms. It's like yeah, <laughs> these are all my victims. They flew by Suplex City. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, better yet, make Brock Lesnar the golden snitch. Oh. <laughs> and just there like, ah, we're okay with losing my like, like, what yeah. are the odds of me taking this man out? And he chases everyone and he's like, come on! Come on! Me. Come on! Fight me! Everybody's come like, on. no! And you get that one guy who's like, yeah, I can take him. And he gets f 5 into his own broom. <laughs> <laughs> Through the goalpost. <laughs> As the ref sees nothing. I don't know what like, ah, I'm not part of this game anymore. <laughs> Lesnar steps in, referee. In. <laughs> the ref is just there. He's that, he's that ref for, de for tennis, just sitting on that high chair. Like. He's just there like, 10 points to you. <laughs> it's like knockout. Ref, he broke my leg. Five points for him. Well, what were you doing with your leg so high up? I was playing the game. <laughs> The ref that just gives no Fs is just there sitting. Hmm. Five points. <laughs> Low blow, illegal. Someone complains, that's it, you're disqualified. You're out! Then he does that weird thing with the arm. You're out of here! What? 
right? But I just, right? Wait, does Skate I'm, even have normal, like, does it have subs? The fans get to jump through whatever <laughs> they want. Wrestling is just invading every aspect of this hypothetical. No, 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 no. Other players are hiding as members of the audience, right? Ah. The fans. So then it's, you'll just spontaneously see someone jump off the stands and it's like, Oh my god, that guy's gonna... Oh, he's flying. Mm-hmm. Oh wait, what is he gonna do with that? He just ran into the snitch! He ran into the snitch! Oh, oh my word! You just see Brock Lesnar plumb you too. Before he hits the ground, he manages an F5. <laughs> he just F5 someone. <laughs> like, he... As long as he, he rips through space and time <laughs> to grab a victim to F5 them into the ground. As long as he F5 someone, he's still in the match. And he's still in. <laughs> then he looks up as the boom comes to him. He sees the person who tackled him. Right? <laughs> like, Points at next. you. Oh, and then Goldberg shows up. You're not just next. You're last. <laughs> he's just plowing <laughs> people. <laughs> yes. No, Goldberg should be the stage. He should be the stage. No, just two snitches each team. Yes! One team gets Brock Lesnar, the other one gets Goldberg. Goldberg. But here's the thing, Goldberg just randomly rams into people from no, literally nowhere. <laughs> it's like, I'm winning! I'm winning! And then you just hear the magical sound. <laughs> Goldberg, you're next! You just see someone looking at you like, Oh dear God, let me, let me! Like that's, that's when you see men become religious. Please love me, love me, love me, please love me. Love me. Love me. Love me. <laughs> It wasn't me! Whoever the poor victim was. No! <laughs> and those skilled players make sure it's like, I think it's gonna be me. So he makes sure he gets the snitch, the, the Brock Lesnar snitch. And he's like, come on, come on, come on, come on. And just moves out of the way just as Bro Goldberg shows up. <laughs> Wait, how the scoring system go? Would it be squishy scoring system? Um, or? At the end of the day, everybody only cares about the snitch, so. The points would be inconsequential. Hey, basically, maybe they have like maybe they have like the three judges for boxing. It's like uh, yes, his form was excellent, but he missed like five points. He <laughs> missed. He didn't secure the neck lock properly. Minus three points. Oh, Brock Lesnar executed an F five, so he's still in the match. Okay, I can just imagine them with calm voices as this chaos is happening. Ooh, they could also be the announcers. Like, <laughs> and Brock Lesnar has entered the chat. Wait, no. <clears throat> Copyright. Uh, and the big snitch. No. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we'll just call him Brock Lesnar. We don't yeah. care. Names are names. And, and BL enters the fray. And he's executed two F5 simultaneously. Oh, wow. Oh, that excellent. means both teams lose uh, 10 points? 10, 10 points. points. Yes, 10 sir. points. Yes, oh, they lose 10 points. And it seems that Goldberg has to enter the match now. Shall I press the button? Ooh, uh, can so I press the button this time? Let's yes, all press it together. We're civil here. Uh, and it's the most annoying sound. <laughs> <laughs> everybody in the in the ring is everybody in the arena is just like, oh dear God, no, oh dear God, where is he coming from? Where is he coming from? They see like you know in horror movies where the the thingy that that's hunting the people moves like really fast in the shadows, so you only see a blur of motion. Yeah. That's what you see behind the stairs. Just shout. It always shout, kills shout. me in horror movies when that happens. Like, it can move faster than the eye can track, but then when it's actually an eye shot, it's somehow as slow as a bus. It's so slow, you're just like, I, I can see you, yes, and I'm coming to kill you. I mean, like, dude, you were moving so quickly when you were not in eye shot, what happened? I, what, is your special ability fast movement without eye shot? What? What, what is this? <clears throat> The horror movie ability where when nobody's looking you can materialize in front of them. That's actually in a game. I think it was a Friday the 13th game where you can either be the hunter or the hunted. Mm. So it's like if you're not in eye shot, you can use this weird ability where you can... You're standing still but you're phasing, just walking. You just teleport to some random point on the map and it's like... What weirds well, me out is that walls affect you. And I'm like, how? how? Cause you can't move through walls in <laughs> Yeah, but then you just hit a wall and you stop, but then your the ability is still running, so you either have to reverse and go around, or you're stuck there and you mirror it, rematerialize and you have to walk the rest of the way. <laughs> Wait, that reminds me of this one scene in Scary Movie 3 or 2? Which one was it? Where the ghost is like moving around and it's like, huh? <laughs> Gets lost. <laughs> I'm not supposed to. Oh, Scary Movie 2. <laughs> Where it's like the ghost is moving through, moving through, looking around, like, huh? 
wait, have you seen? You've seen yeah. it, right? Yeah. Mm. And you know the, the part where the ghost bangs that chick, and now and the ghost goes to the <laughs> and it seems like it's these pictures where the chick drew over the ghost's original wife, and uh, it's like, choose me, choose me. It's like, bruh, no. Just uh, uh, run away. Yeah. Yeah. It'll be like that. It's like, <laughs> another wall. <laughs> <laughs> But I smell fear. Mm-hmm. Alright, I'm just going to rematerialize here. Now to walk slowly. <laughs> okay, okay, so that's already two sports. Lesnar and Combat Ball. Combat Ball. <laughs> let's see, let's see if we can make one up right now. Okay, I'll come up, I'll give you an original sport. And then you, okay, we'll come up with an original sport and then we'll try and combine it with something else here. Right. But real quick, um, I looked into weird sports the other day, okay. and there was one that really caught my attention. Chess boxing. Oh, yes. <laughs> Chess boxing. <laughs> this is an actual thing that exists <laughs> from what I've seen. And <laughs> how it works is um, there are five rounds. Like the, player, the, the contestants alternate between five rounds of chess and boxing. So now, <laughs> depending on which one you lead in with, if you lead in with chess, you're kind of praying that you're the better chess player. But at the same time, when it comes to the boxing part, you're praying that you don't get a concussion because it makes chess that, <laughs> that much, much more, more difficult. difficult. <laughs> it's like, how does this one move again? Is it an, a W? It's an L. The, so okay, it's like it's, that one. Is 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 like L M N O. I smell copper. <laughs> I win by TKO <laughs> after sitting down. Yeah, but that's a weird sport, though. Dude, <laughs> not, not as dangerous as axe throwing, though, in my personal opinion. Weird thing is that nowadays boxing is more dangerous than bare knuckle boxing. Shit, like, how? Don't the gloves have padding in them? That's the point. Like, with bare knuckle boxing, if you punch someone in the head with your bare hand, you're, you're breaking yourself. Like, True. so now the padding gives you ample oh. opportunity to aim for the head. <laughs> so so like, it's like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you a concussion this time. <laughs> so in knuckle boxing, the matches could go on for hours because the body can take massive amounts of damage. True. The head only so many hits before something goes wrong. <laughs> <laughs> so there have been records where like whole, the whole day spent between two people just beating the ever-loving Piss out of each other. Oh, <laughs> and you, you see, and that's the fun thing is like, with now with, with boxing, you'd see like this man's a boxer. You see his nose now pointing in five directions. <laughs> knuckle boxing. If they don't take off and show you the bruises, you're like, ah, oh, this man's just a bodybuilder, and you walk on your way. No, you'd be like, no, this guy's an accountant. Yeah, he's, he's just a really buff, buff accountant. Account. He's I mean, like, like, you gotta is- keep. This is what I do for a living. And you're like, I oh ble- my word! I bleed internally every time I need to take. <laughs> <laughs> this is my life. But, but you've never had a concussion, right? Animal. Never had a concussion. An IQ of one ninety. <laughs> Boxes be there. My IQ is one ninety. Oh, that's not bad. <laughs> it was three hundred when I started. Oh. Goddamn! Stop! <laughs> Quit! <laughs> wait, wait, wait. You started with an IQ of 300 and you went to boxing. You deserve to lose those IQ points. You are now... <laughs> you are now above average. Congratulations. Uh, I want to keep boxing because the guy who took my IQ has more IQ than me. So I want to bring him down too. Yeah, I don't think he's gonna agree to that. He's just there like, it's on! I'll mess you up, pal! Oh yeah, back, back, oh man, we, we, we got sidetracked the biggest. Okay. Yeah. Uh, hmm. I mean... Basketball, uh, I don't really understand enough rules to actually make it weird. Uh, how about badminton, but with... Dodgeball? Dodgeball, yes. And the ball explodes randomly. I think there was a game like that in Madagascar. But it's, it's kind of like hot potato. <laughs> yes, hot potato with badminton. <laughs> that is what it shall be called. <laughs> hot badminton, potato badminton? It's not, it's that, it's that scene from Total Drama. It's not badminton, it's good minton. 
It's, it's great meeting. <laughs> that will be the that will be the anthem of the sport. We need to get the guy who voices Chris McLean to do it. He's the only one who can. He's the only one who owns that voice. So it's badminton, but with a grenade. With a grenade, yes. No, no, not just any grenade because, you know, uh, grenades kill, like concussive grenades. So that the people only get knocked out, they don't die. So if it explodes on you, if it explodes on you, it's one point for the other team. But if it hits the ground, it's two points, so they have to keep it up. If it hits the ground, it's one point. If it explodes on you, it's two points. So now it's like really frantic playing. Like, I, I cannot give you these two points. I cannot. Everyone else is just watching two, people, two grown adults playing a game. No, I mean, like, because, because of the anticipation, you'd be on the edge of your seat. Where is it going to go? Who's going to get it? 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 you. You got wrecked. And then imagine if it blows up. Like in midair, like or like those weird accents. You know, like when the ball just hits you in the face. <laughs> you meant like point blank concussive grenade. <laughs> oh man, <laughs> double impact because it blows up and it pushes you back into the ground. Mm -hmm. So you're just there. <laughs> Are you okay? I can <laughs> smell the rainbow. You can just have the voiceover from JoJo's be like, and Michael Bay has retired. <laughs> <laughs> Obligatory JoJo's reference, one of maybe, maybe. five. There's gonna know. be a lot of JoJo reference. There's gonna be a lot. Mm. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. What's the start of this game? I feel like it has to be something fun. <clears throat> Go so, ahead, Mr. Jost. <laughs> no, no, no. How about this? As the game starts, when the grenade gets thrown in, Kill our Queen! <laughs> Totally cap off the video with a Jojo reference? The ultimate Jojo reference. And I have it now. Okay. Since we've done basically three sports, yes. this is the outro. Thank you for listening. This is us signing out. Please like and subscribe if you're new and comment below on your combination of sports. And do share this video. Share it to the world of Tokyo Tomare! Oh. oh, we've gone off the rails with this. We have gone. It is my fault. I apologize. Back to the, the made up sports. Ah, no, we're done with the made up sports now. Oh, we're remember, done with the, oh, okay. remember the Remember the scene I gave you? The one with the. With the girl oh, I have on my phone. With the little girl e going. E oh, wait, wait, wait. Anime. Anime. Anime is the very important word I left out there. Anime. Yes, I was, I'll put up the video, I hope. Yes. Yeah, the, it's, the it's video. a fun meme. It's a five sec 25 seconds? I think it's like 10. 10 yeah, seconds. it's pretty 10 quick. Seconds. Now I was talking about this. Where is it? Where is it? No, 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 We up here. Ah, no. That's the Oh Boy One More song, right? Yeah, 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 boy. I think it was after this. Go to it. No, don't forward. Show in chat. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ah, this one. Let <laughs> uh, like explain to me why you were so fired. <laughs> why you were fired? <laughs> <laughs> yes. I totally, I'm so sorry, I totally forgot that. Should I write down the script? So that no, I've got it, I've got it. Yeah. Nope. We're about to just make a little skit. <laughs>